forget the majestic lion who are the king of the jungle. In today's video, we'll be exploring who and how powerful the African wild dogs are. These spotted, sleek hunters may not have the sheer size of a lion, but their relentless teamwork, cunning strategies, and lightning-fast chases make them a force to take seriously in the safari, and also they strike fear into the hearts of lions and other animals that are two times their size. We'll be unraveling the myths and also unveil the science behind how dangerous this hyena-looking animals, and witness firsthand why the African wild dogs are the undisputed champions of the chase in the wild. The African wild dog, also known as the painted dog or lycaon pictus, is actually a member of the canine family. While they share some superficial similarities with hyenas, their closest relatives are actually wolves and foxes. The superficial resemblance between African wild dogs and hyenas is a fascinating example of convergent evolution, where different species develop similar traits due to adapting to similar environments and ecological niches. These extremely dangerous animals are popular for their spotted coats, complex social structures, and incredible hunting skills. They work together in packs, strategically chasing and harassing their prey until it weakens and tires. Their teamwork allows them to take down prey much larger than themselves, like wildebeest, buffalo or even the king of the jungle. Wild dogs have incredible stamina and can chase for miles, slowly wearing down their prey. Their unique bone structure and efficient lungs contribute to their remarkable endurance. Their sharp teeth with serrated edges are perfectly adapted for tearing flesh, and their powerful bite can crush bones. This allows them to quickly dismember and consume their prey. Unlike lions who rely on bursts of speed and power, wild dogs are the marathon runners of the predator world. They chase buffalo relentlessly, hour after hour, their stamina fueled by a pack mentality and an unwavering hunger. Even against the immense power of a buffalo, the dogs never relent. They employ clever tactics, flanking the herd, distracting one of the buffalo pack, and targeting vulnerable areas like the legs and underbelly. They communicate constantly, their yelps and barks a sign of strategy guiding their movements. The African wild dog's cooperative hunting is truly a spectacle to watch, featuring impressive teamwork and complex strategies. Roles within the pack include The chasers, these dogs initiate the chase, often targeting a specific prey based on their experience and pack strategy. The flankers, they run alongside the prey, nipping at the legs and flanks to keep it running in the desired direction. The trippers, these individuals lie in wait, strategically positioning themselves to trip or slow down the fleeing prey. And then the finishers. Once the prey weakens, the finishers move in for the kill with a swift bite to the throat or neck. This dangerous animals adjust their tactics based on the prey and terrain. They might use ambushes against smaller prey or wear down larger animals through persistence. They can even split up temporarily, with some individuals flanking while others stay with the chase, then reunite for the final attack. Despite their small size compared to some prey, their hunting strategies result in a high success rate, often exceeding 80%, which is mind-blowing for an animal of this size. These dogs are the fiercest and most focused when they're on the hunt, employing their honed skills and teamwork to secure their food source. Like any predator, they may be more aggressive if they're starving or protecting their young or territory. They also have great communication and coordination through vocalizations. They use a variety of barks, whines, and yelps to communicate their position, intent, and strategy during the hunt process. The feeding habits of African wild dogs are just as fascinating as their cooperative hunting. African wild dogs are incredibly efficient scavengers. They leave little to no remains, consuming nearly all edible parts of the carcass. This minimizes waste and prevents scavengers like hyenas from stealing their precious meal. As dangerous as these animals can be, there are a lot of misconceptions about them. It's assumed that they pose a threat to humans, but these dangerous wild dogs are highly fearful of humans and generally avoid contact. Attacks on humans are incredibly rare and usually provoked by extreme circumstances. People also believe their colorful coats are camouflage, but the fur patterns actually serve social purposes, aiding in individual recognition and pack cohesion. 
Each dog's coat is unique, making it easier for pack mates to identify each other during hunts and social interactions. African wild dogs, once prevalent across much of sub-Saharan Africa, have faced significant habitat loss and population decline. Today, their primary regions of existence include Southern Africa countries like Botswana, South Africa, and Namibia and East Africa countries like Tanzania, Kenya, and Zimbabwe. Scattered populations also exist in Mozambique, Zambia, and Ethiopia, but their numbers are relatively low and require ongoing conservation efforts. Unfortunately, due to habitat fragmentation, disease outbreaks, and competition with other predators, wild dog populations remain fragmented and vulnerable. Continued conservation efforts are crucial to ensure their survival and recovery in these regions. Let us know in the comments section if you have ever heard of this ferocious animal. That wraps up the video for today guys, we hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to subscribe to Insight.tv, leave a thumbs up, and of course share the video. Until the next time see you in the next video.